What's up, Phantomodes? What's going on? Welcome back to another update. This is going to be an update for my tennis elbow surgery. Uh, elbow surgery, um, there's another medical term for tennis elbow surgery, but I don't know it. Anyway, a year and a half ago, January 26, 2018, I had... Um, 2018? 2017, I had tennis elbow surgery. And um, right now, the way I feel is that I feel a little pain in my elbow right now. Um, I did feel pain. Uh, it's a slight pain. It's not a lot. Uh, I don't know what happened. I did physical therapy for like um, uh, three months, but it wasn't really an intense physical therapy. It was just basically rubbing a uh, gel with this this type of, um, I forget, the, it's like a, I don't know what you call it. It was a, a machine with some gel and you rub it up and down, rub it up in circles, whatever like that. I did a uh, home exercise with my wrist going up and down like that, this way, that different, different directions and stuff like that. Um, I don't know, man. She, you know, I, I even did the exercise with, with like a five pound weight, two, first I started with like a one pound, then gradually worked up to a two pound, then a three pound and four or five. And then up to like maybe, uh, I think 10 pounds we went up to. Uh, we did physical therapy for like three months, three months of physical therapy. Um, uh, wasn't really strong, you know, squeezing a ball, I think it was, and just, I don't know. It felt like it wasn't doing much, the physical therapy. So, if you guys are going to go, if, I don't, and I thought that was normal, the physical therapy she was giving me. So, we do that for three months, and then, um, I don't know, then, you know, maybe, like, I started going to the gym, like, maybe four months afterwards, and doing a very, very light workout. And within the second week of the, of the workout... Um, I started feeling a pain here. So I was like, what the hell? Why is there pain there, man? You go, you if you you shouldn't feel no pain at all. And I was feeling some some sort of pain right here. And this is a scar right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. That's the scar that you get. So I don't know, man. Right now, I just started going back to the gym. I stopped working out completely. I was like, no way, I'm not working out. That's it. I'm not doing this. And at the time I had my elbow situation. My shoulder situation going on, so I had I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna work out. I got a shoulder, I got a, still got a bad shoulder. They fixed my elbow. I'm, you know, I'm gonna chill and just not work out for um, a while. And I got fat. <laughs> like, I got, like, so now I'm now I'm back at the gym. Um, I feel my shoulder is amazing. Like I said in my last video, but the elbow, I still feel some. There's something here. There's definitely something going on here. I may eventually have to get an MRI. I don't know. I've been going, this is, my sec, this, is my, uh, this is my second week back at the gym, and I do feel pretty good, but it's not 100%. So I don't know what to do. So I'm going to wait it out, keep going to the gym, and see what happens. I hope it goes away, may not go away, and, and I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what's going to happen. So um, that's my update. I still have a little bit of pain here. And it might, it might be even in, a, in another 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 uh, location. Maybe because I had I think concentrating here, I feel pain over here. So maybe or over here I feel pain. So maybe another spot tore. I don't know, man. So I all I know is if it gets really painful because the first the, when the the pain I had for the for the for before I had the surgery was really 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 excruciating pain. It was like almost bad where I can I was almost like gonna cry. I was like. Because when you're having pain here for like months, year, or a year and a half or so, you, it gets worse. And you just like, it, the pain gets annoying after a while. He's like, damn, I want to have surgery already, please. I want surgery. So, I don't know, man. I'm just praying that it doesn't go, it doesn't get worse. And I'm doing very, no, I'm not doing very light works. I'm doing, I guess, I guess I did biceps. I did uh, alternate dumbbell curls. Of 25 pounds, three sets. Then I did, um, uh, what did I just do? Then I did a curling bar, standing curling bar, a 45 pound curling bar. And then I did three sets of like 10 reps. And then I did preacher curls of wide, wide. No, I didn't, I didn't close. No, I had like an, on, a, on a wide uh, preacher curls, three sets of like eight, yeah. Eight reps, and then I did a, a, a light concentration, like you put you, you go all the way down and you just go like that, 
like three sets of like 12, I think I did, or 10. So I, I might have went overdid it yesterday. So yes, I think I did overdo it. But I, I feel good today. And um, I don't feel, I, I really don't feel pain here. You know, I don't feel, I don't feel that much. I don't really don't feel pain. So, so far, so good. So my advice to you guys is if you're going to have el tennis elbow surgery, wait at least six months, nine months to a year until you start working out. Because I'm having a little bit of a problem here, and it's not 100%. Like, my shoulder is like 97%, 96 This is like, I don't know, 65%, maybe 70 So there's something, I think there's something in there, something may be happening. I don't know what exactly. Um, hopefully, it gets better and doesn't get worse. And I hope me working out right now will build it up maybe and make it better not worse and if it does get worse if i do feel more pain i am going to get another mri done and um maybe get another surgery done which i don't want to do because that that soft cast from here to here was a pain in the butt trust me i don't want to do that again man so there's an update for you guys i hope it helped if you have any questions comments concerns please leave it below down here someplace and let me know um what you think because even if I go if I, if I go like I do a dab it like I can feel a little bit of pain here like you see like that because <laughs> sometimes I do a dabs after my I do a dab after my live streams I'll be like yo alright see you guys later and I'm like damn what the hell <laughs> so be careful with the dabs the, ba the dabs may do it the dabs may ruin your tennis elbow surgery so no but seriously um I'm back at the gym so far, so good. I feel a little bit of pain, but not that bad. It's not serious. Trust me. It's like if it was serious, I wouldn't. I wouldn't be working out. So it's like I said. It's a little bit something there. Maybe something's going on. I don't know. We'll find out in time. In time, you will know what it's like to feel pain. <laughs> so I don't know, man. Like I said. Questions, comments, concerns, please leave them below. And that's the video for you. Uh, that's an update. Um, and uh, good luck. If you're going to have surgery, please, those of you who are going to have this surgery, don't worry about it. You won't feel a thing. They knock you out. You fall asleep. You wake up with a cast on your arm and you take your medicine, painkillers. You won't feel nothing. Trust me, I felt barely no pain. Don't get that stupid ice machine. You don't need no ice machine for your shoulder. You don't need ice machine for your elbow. No ice machine. Just get the packs, ice packs that they give, and boom, you're fine. I didn't get the ice machine for either, for this or this. So um, that's it, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope I, can have, I hope it was informative for you. And um, I just hope that um, I don't need another, another surgery. And I hope this heals um, just fine. But uh, if I need another surgery, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go and have another surgery. Hope you guys um, like this video. <laughs> That's it, man. I'm sorry. I'm just like, it's a little frustrating, but I'm going, I'm getting along and um, I'm, only time can tell. That's all I can say. Only time can tell. Just in peace. See, that didn't hurt right there. It didn't hurt. Let me see. <laughs> that didn't hurt. So maybe we'll back on track. Maybe going to the gym now, a year later, a year and a half later, we'll make it better. I don't know. We shall see. I'll give you I'll give you another update in a couple months and see what happens, man. Like I said, if you're having a surgery, please comment below. Let me know um what I, how I can help you. If I haven't done so already. What information do you need? What information do you want? What information? will be useful for you down the line, down the road. I don't know. Bye. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it, man. I'll see you guys next video. Bye. <laughs>